Now, Detroit police are releasing few details into the investigation. We do know that the teacher's body was found with a gunshot wound. He was very popular here at Cody High School. He'd been here for more than a decade. Family, friends, and classmates of Dewan Joyner mourning the loss of the popular teacher. The 33-year-old was found inside his Sussex Street home in Detroit yesterday afternoon, a gunshot wound to his body. Family members tell Action News he'd been at Cody High School for more than 10 years. Students leaving Cody today tell us they had a great deal of respect for him. He was really nice and, you know, he was cool with everybody. He was really friendly and, you know, he, he was really, you know, nice to everybody, basically. He liked to help people. He used to like to help people, so, you know, that was the best part of him. He used to help, like, people that want to drop on stuff. Joyner was an English teacher at Cody who also helped students with the yearbook. Detroit police will only say the circumstances surrounding Mr. Joyner's death are unknown. But sources at the medical examiner's office confirmed to Action News that it was a homicide and no weapon was found at the scene. Students say many of their classmates were in tears today as word spread of the teacher's death. Even though I was doing bad, he always motivated me to do good. And he always, he always told me stop hanging around the in crowd, just hang around the crowd that want to be something. And stay positive, never negative. Detroit police say the investigation is in its preliminary stage right now. They are not saying what may have led to the death. Students, meantime, are planning a vigil. We're live in Detroit, Michael Rosenfield, 7 Action News. All right, thank you, Michael. A spokesman for DPS sent 7 Action News an email saying the Detroit school district is saddened at the teacher's death and the district has a crisis team to talk to students and staff.